tutti and welcome to Mangia Bene with Gianfranco. Today is a very special day we have today. We're gonna make a very authentic Roman dish. Spaghetti alla carbonara. Okay, so we're gonna start with beautiful spaghetti. Beautiful. And now we're gonna have guanciale. Chopped up guanciale is the most authentic you're gonna get to the most real carbonara. If you don't have a guanciale, you can use pancetta. If you don't have pancetta, you can use bacon. Okay, and then you're gonna have nice eggs here. You wanna use anywhere between four to six eggs. Okay, usually it's one per person who's gonna be eating the pasta. That's what I go by. And then you're gonna have a nice freshly grated pecorino romano. And we're gonna mix it all together and a little black and black pepper. Okay, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be very authentic and it's gonna be very delicious. So let's put it all together. So now we're gonna whisk these eggs. We're gonna get these all whisked up here. All right, and then we're gonna add the pecorino romano and the black pepper. Okay, pecorino romano. And the black pepper a good amount of black pepper this is traditional Roman dish so now we're gonna salt the water and add the pasta the water is already boiling here and we add the pasta in. now we're gonna start with the one chale. The pan is already heated up for us, and now we can add this. You want to get this nice, a little crispy. The oil from the fats is all gonna juice up here. You don't have to add anything at all. It's already, you know, salty and oily. You'll be fine. So now we turned off the heat on the one child because now we don't want to burn. We're going to let it cool down a little bit. We're going to take a little bit of this salted, boiling hot water here. We're gonna add it into this. Okay. Okay, so now we're gonna add some of the pasta here right to our one shallow mixture. Alright. Get it all covered up. Over. And now we're going to add the mix. Now, you see how it thickened up. It's so nice, it's creamy now, it's beautiful. And you know, this is a very authentic dish. So please, there's no actual, there's no heavy cream, there's no peas. Please don't put that in there. And if you ever go to an Italian restaurant and you see that on the menu, walk out of the restaurant because it's not authentic Roman carbonara. This is authentic. Look at this. This is beautiful. This is so nice. You have no idea.
So now it's everybody's favorite part once again to taste. Allora, cominciamo, okay? This is, I mean, you can tell how beautiful it is. Look at this. Maron. Look at that. Look, 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 look how perfect on the fork. Look. Perfetto. Maron, what? Mm. Mm. This is very special. Molto speciale. This is so delicious. The best authentic Roman carbonara you ever taste in your life. And I tell you, Caesar himself comes to eat in my house. It's the best. And it's very simple to make. And you're going to love it. So please, try it. Try it at home. Because it's very authentic, very delicious. And of course, your glass of wine. And like what I say, now your evening is complete. And that's it! We have reached the end again to Mangia Bene with Gianfranco and I hope you, you make this dish at home. Please comment below, make it at home, like, subscribe, share and tell everybody in the world of Gianfranco Lava.